In a dazzling display of elegance and resilience, the Prince and Princess of Wales graced the Royal Variety performance with their presence at the iconic London Palladium. This annual event, a staple of British entertainment, welcomed them back, following their memorable appearances. This year, the occasion held even more significance as Catherine has recently emerged from her battle with cancer treatment, showcasing not only her remarkable recovery but also her enduring spirit. Catherine captivated the audience in a breathtaking custom black lace gown by Alexander McQueen, which cascaded elegantly to the floor. The gown featured a daring scooped back and a sweetheart neckline, beautifully accentuating her figure. As she walked the red carpet in towering black stiletto heels, her glossy chestnut hair flowed in loose curls, adding to her glamorous appearance. This evening, Catherine chose a bolder makeup look than usual, with smoky eyes that highlighted her features, complemented by a subtle nude lipstick. She accessorized with striking gold hoop earrings adorned with pearl drops, opting for a minimalist approach by wearing only her engagement and wedding rings. A sleek black clutch bag completed her sophisticated look, perfectly matching the ensemble. Prince William, ever the charming gentleman, looked sharp in a traditional black tuxedo. As they entered the theatre, he affectionately placed a hand on Catherine's back, a tender gesture that reflected their deep bond. Their presence not only raised the glamour stakes but also highlighted their commitment to supporting the arts and entertainment community. The Royal Variety Performance, a cherished tradition since its inception in 1912, raises funds to assist entertainers across the UK who face challenges due to age, illness, or difficult circumstances. As Catherine spoke to guests after the show, she shared a delightful tidbit. Her children, Prince Louis and Princess Charlotte, enjoy performing acrobatics at home, particularly handstands and cartwheels. This glimpse into their family life added a touch of warmth to the evening. Leading up to the event, the couple took to their Kensington Royal Instagram account to share a series of nostalgic photographs. Among these were a stunning black and white image of the Queen attending the Royal Variety performance in 1952, alongside the Prince of Edinburgh and Princess Margaret. Another photograph captured a pregnant Catherine in a beautiful Diane von Furstenberg gown during the 2014 event, showcasing her long-standing connection to this illustrious occasion. The Royal Variety performance has a rich history, originally initiated to honor performers who supported the Variety Artists Benevolent Fund during challenging times, particularly in the aftermath of World War I. The second royal show, held in July 1919, was specifically billed as a celebration of peace, reflecting the King's gratitude for the contributions made by Variety Artists to war relief efforts. Catherine tends to favor modest, classic styles, but she has occasionally opted for dresses with daring design elements, including scooped or lower necklines. One of Catherine's most iconic fashion moments came shortly after her wedding in 2011 when she attended the ARK Gala in a shimmering pink sequin gown by Jenny Packham. The gown featured a scooped neckline with delicate cap sleeves, and the sparkling embellishments made it one of her most glamorous looks. The neckline was slightly daring but remained elegant, making this one of her standout appearances. In 2012, Catherine attended a private dinner at Claridge's in a sleek, off-white gown by Roland Mowrett. The dress featured a daring scooped neckline and a thigh-high slit, showing a more glamorous and bold side to her style. The structured silhouette of the gown, paired with her effortless waves, gave the look a polished yet daring edge. At the 2011 Sun Military Awards, Catherine wore a stunning black velvet Alexander McQueen gown with a sweetheart neckline and scooped bodice. The strapless gown was both daring and elegant, offering a more dramatic look than her usual choices. Paired with a simple diamond bracelet and earrings, this appearance remains one of her most memorable red carpet moments. At the Art Fund Museum of the Year Awards in 2016, Catherine turned heads in a white, figure-hugging off-the-shoulder dress by Brazilian designer Barbara Casazola. The dress featured a scooped neckline and a bodicon fit, highlighting her toned figure. The dress's minimalist design, combined with its daring neckline, gave Catherine a sleek and modern look. For the premiere of the James Bond film Spectre, 
Catherine wowed in a pale blue Jenny Packham gown with a plunging, scooped neckline. The flowing, sheer fabric and soft pleats added an ethereal quality to the gown, while the neckline gave the look a more daring edge. It was a perfect choice for the glamorous event and one of her most striking red carpet moments. At the UK premiere of War Horse, Catherine wore a beautiful black lace Tempele London dress with a low, scooped neckline. The intricate lace detailing added an element of romance to the dress, while the neckline offered a slightly more daring look compared to her usual choices. It was a refined yet bold outfit that showcased her evolving style. These dresses show how Catherine can embrace a slightly more daring look with scooped or lower necklines while maintaining her signature elegance and class. Whether it's a glamorous gala or a red carpet event, her bold fashion choices always make a statement.